1311 1311 Tuesday 5th January 2021 Vivaldi The Four Seasons You are first in the queue Welcome Nowadays, everybody got something to say When they move the lips, nothing comes out but a bunch of gibberish Yet what? Stand up! Stand up! When I move, you move, just like that When I move, you move, just like that Peter Piper picks a peckle, pickle pepper in propia persona Yeah, what, 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 what? Vivaldi, the Four Seasons January is where we are. Let's go with a remix. What? What? Spring, summer, autumn, winter. Matthew, Mark, Luke, John. SPLSPro.com with a Christian disclosure in your face. That was a right beginning, wasn't it, eh? That was a re beginning. It's a Facebook. This is going to be downloaded and put on Tube. All right. I'm coming in to say what? Let's have a chat. Hey, that was a good beginning. I just wrapped some Eminem. I just did some ludicrous ghosts of worship. It's time to incarnate. Let's turn that off. Thank you, Vivaldi. The Four Seasons. What? Ghosts of War, it's time to be incarnate, okay? Hello to the brothers and the fam that have just joined. I've come to say, what? How are we doing? I don't know if there are empty hospitals, Steve Bennett. That's a, uh, that's a bravo post there. If you go to the homepage of splspro.com, you will find um, Space Cowboy video. Um, Back to the Future, Great Scott, Marty. McFly and um, you will see the original um, coverage exposure of the London 2012 Olympics Danny Boyle opening ceremony done by YouTube's very own Space Cowboy on the homepage of splspro.com I'm going to uh, to say that that post will be marked and uh, removed by the uh, the Nick Clegg um, liberal Democrat Facebook fact checker 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 very soon um, we don't like checkers we're interested in ex checkers that would be the Chancellor Mr Rishi Sunak the second Lord of the Treasury aka Mr Chancellor of the ex checker all right uh, Tartaria by Sister Karen aka Sun and Moon but and Moon um, mud floods, interested in them. There's a lot of them. There's a lot of buried civilizations under mud. Gebekele Tepe. Um, and say no more. Buried under landslides. Uh, the Bosnian pyramids. Dr. Sab Osmanovic. The uh, aggregate that is removing from the tunnel ravines that should lead to one of the world's largest pyramids. Pyramids? Pyramidiates all around, so Tartaria, mud floods, we know about them and uh, we like them a lot. They're nothing new, many, many, many of them under the sun. Christian Disclosure, what's all that about? That's something that I have coined. You will see a post there about uh, Caesar's Messiah. Um, not just my own work, there is some disclaimers in there. You will see about the uh, Roman invention of the Caesar's Messiah. Who do you love? And who loves you? The Messiah. The Temple of Dreams. I believe that tune was. It's time to start running. Well, we're stopping running. We've called a truce a trust. We are giving to you a little bit of a Christian disclosure. Let me find this video where I am. I'm going to share this out. And uh, we're going to say, what? Big shout going out to Brother T. O N Y. Anybody got any questions? Anybody got any comments? I'm not going to be here for long. I just thought I'd pop in on this um, lockdown version 3. Um, the sequel wasn't bad. 
the original one was horrific shocking and here we are in number three um you may only leave your homes legislative not me this is the prime minister the uno minister minister number one um boris of the johnson mr boris johnson the first lord of the tr of the treasury he was on the uh, broadcasting airwaves last night transmission saying you may only leave your homes according to uk of gb government legislation that is mandated upon your person by default okay that's where i'm coming from this isn't i david i am repeating and regurgitating the first lord of the treasury known as the uno minister prime mini star boris of the johnson flam and uh, he said certain things there and one of them being the last one being if you are escaping domestic violence i find it disgusting disturbing that on national tv this great buffoon um, and i will call him a buffoon and a liar and i have proof of that um it's saying that uh, emergency medical care um necessity of getting food and um you know uh, escaping domestic violence so to my ghosts of the war and warship it is time to incarnate um come alive obviously the ghosts of war um legal dead fictions when i say mandated upon your person by default out of westminster or westminster you are all considered legal entities that are um you know and the publications and the christian disclosure all of our works that are coming out right now um, and being put together and amalgamated underneath the Eli, which is the evidence of life essence incarnate proclamation that we are inviting you to consider um, having a lawful um, proclamation to show that you are man with person. All right. Using legal, using lawful, using trust law, equity, Abrahamic and um, ultimately international governance, covenants. Um, interfaceable by all for all of our family around the world yes youtube yes facebook um, this is how it's going to roll i am going to put this video onto youtube another disclaimer if you interact with me if you interact with this facebook fam this is a public open trust and it will be shared and we will uh, we will work as one family okay so uh, i find it horrific that uh, russell kane um of youtube uh, video yesterday update on lockdown number three um telling us that he wants to smash his face into a book until his eye pops out and the eye juice comes out because he has a five-year-old and the five-year-old is going to drive him mad at a time when man has just celebrated um some of you the saturnalia the pagan ritual of the 25th of december uh this is why we're going into the christian disclosure you will find the 6th of december tomorrow an interesting date and you will find april um, an interesting date we have the uh, greek orthodox in europe and we have the roman catholic over here as well and uh christians catholic islam uh, and uh, judaism alike i'm going to bring the houses back together but i find it disturbing that are mixed demographic lost tribes of the uh, ghosts of war that are presently here now on this landmass cannot get along with their family you need to be beaten um, you need to be beating you are beating you are having wine o'clock at nine o'clock a.m you can't find the time or enjoy the time to spend with your family and blood um, long periods of time in an enclosed space make you get vexatious um, to the ones that you love and um, women um, i'm talking to you as well the omegas i'm talking to the alphas it's not just men being violent to women women are being violent to men and um, such comedians as russell kane kane of the russell um, bbc radio 4 coming on saying uh, people can't cope um, uh, news bbc um, British Broadcasting Cooperation putting out narratives where ladies are coming on saying I can't cope with my family and trying to run what do you mean you can't cope you've got a family you've got time um, if you can't cope we ask for help you don't necessarily have to go to the state or a private nursery we can help each other this is all about our community love and care and sharing sharing is caring so the fact that yesterday between 8 p.m. GMT Mr. Boris Johnson 
gave a list of reasons why man can leave their home under legislation for um, excusable reasons. That will be the Queen. And one of them was to escape domestic violence, get medical care um, alongside many other things. So I find it really, really amazing and disturbing that we cannot spend time with our family and not kill each other, beat each other or think about having wine at 9 a.m. Um, I am not perfect. I am not a saint, but I love spending time with my fam and my blood. Um, if you're on another continent and you have domestic violence um, on the rise, um, we need to talk because obviously we are a little bit pissed off with one another. We do not relish spending time with our blood in the private. Uh, we moan about going to the job the job for the man you know and uh, being a slave in the rat race and when we get the time to be in the private with our blood we turn to wine alcohol and violence so when i say ghosts of warship time to incarnate you get where i'm coming from fam um you can't wait to watch the video walkthrough of evidence of life that will be Later today, my brother Stuart, there is a private video on uh, the dot com in the domain amongst all those lions and symbols and uh, prophecies that I've put there, prophetic writings and um, what we're going to do. You have been given a preview of that instrument that is the equivalent of a certificate. There is no registration required. We don't want to see your person. We don't need any of the details uh, that uh, have been asked of you by the state legally up to press we don't need anything that the common law courts have asked of you um, to register and uh, follow agent john of the smith family if you want to believe that is his name hmm. uh, moving on we do not need anything that um, 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 we buy any dead uh, debt dead same thing interest uh, dead debt energy or kindness credits ask for we have pioneered and I have invented a brand new, unique, original, um, trademark, intellectual property, um, protected, copyright <laughs> um, process exclusive to the governor and SPLSpro.com, uh, influenced by many areas, biblical, Abrahamic, um, Judaic, Islam, trust, equity, hermetic, um, antiquities, international, um, and I've got all of the articulation ready to uh, provide to the ones that wish to make that jump for the princely amount, credits, sum, promises, fiat currency transfer of £19.99 and pence, not £5,000, not £4,000, not £3,000, not two, not one, not, uh, not £500, not even £50, £19.99, all right? Um, that's all I can say there. We're trying to grow the trust and we're trying to stop man from killing each other. We want to put love back into the community, um, take away the addiction from the fictions. All right. So much like the beginning of this video, if you've just joined, I'd invite you to rewind selector and listen to Vivaldi, the four seasons and my lyrical um, uh, assassination of that <laughs> previously. Yeah. What a day, eh? When we're on what? The 5th of January. Much is going on, all right? I wanted to come in and uh, review what's going off, what's on your mind, and um, let you know there is evidences and uh, videos and stuff in the private for you now. And um, if you aren't in the private, uh, or might I ask why not? Um, property is legally liable to be taken from you. Assets and having title rights to them can't be taken aren't legally visible and are protected it's a simple maneuver to make um, it doesn't use magna carta it doesn't use constitution it doesn't use anything that you've been given previously um, so uh, you know we will pioneer and lead the way as we have done since 2015 since uh, we started talking about triangles set for grantor trustee beneficiary when, uh, when everyone was laughing at us five years, six years ago now, actually, 2015, isn't it? And now everybody is a trust expert, incidentally, years on afterwards. Trust itself, 
comes from Genesis, the Old Testament. It's that old. It didn't come from the Romans and it didn't come as new trust technology pioneered from America's either Winston Strout, Christian Walters or the likes of. Um, I'm moving on to the post. I want to see what go on in here. What's on your mind? Talk to me, SPLS Pro, Facebook, YouTube. This will be premiered at some point and we will have a chat and I will invite you to pause upon any one of these previously mentioned topics and chat to I. Questions about who, what, where, when and how, let me know. There is a document PDF shared as part of the Christian disclosure called Truth. All right, um, I'd like you to look at that. That's um, That's got about 16 pages to it. The next document I shared 11 hours ago was 147 pages deep. Again, as part of the Christian Disclosure, there is a password on there, splspro.com2020, and that is entitled X Mass Story, The Facts, 147 pages. So if you want to stay away from the streaming media sites and you've had enough of the usual Hollywood tricks, then may I suggest you take up some reading this lockdown number three and um, familiarise and frequent yourself with indeed some literature that is part of our Christian disclosure. I refuse to give all of my sources away because the content creators, trolls, shills, unconscionable ones go to where I give you the sources and they take and make out that they've known it since day dot and then present it and sell it, merchandise it and act unconscionably. May I just give love and thanks to everybody so far that has helped I amass this and uh, full disclosure will be given towards the end. For now, I protect my sources. Like I protect you. We protect you. Shout going out to the brother Kevin of the Phillips clan for giving us the conditional acceptance um, that you may or may not want to consider. Um, why do we conditionally accept? This is mainly going out to YouTube now because you in here on Facebook, SPLS Pro, do indeed know why we conditionally accept. It is the highest form um, of keeping in honour next to your rescue boat, the Affidavit. Okay, the conditional acceptance is not arguing. It's not agreeing. Okay, it's simply saying, I hear what you say and I will conditionally accept it. It puts the liability back on the claimant okay so what kevin has done there inside that document that we've given away for free on this public platform and we've put on as a download in the private domain and um you can you can take it or you can leave it but if you wonder why we don't say yes and if you wonder why we don't say no and if you want to know why we take the third option and say maybe okay then this is why, because it puts the liability back on the claimant and keeps you with clean hands. It's part of the doctrine, one of the doctrines that lies at the heart of equity. I won't tell you which Lord said that, but that's quoted from a Lord. We quote the Dennings, we quote the Binghams, we quote the Romleys, we quote lots and lots of Lords. Uh, you know, uh, not that we agree with them all, but when you're going for your constitutional or your Magna Carta and you're trying to get in touch with barons there, you'll find that your friends and your allies and your comrades will be the lords more so than this um, this shizen that's being regurgitated and put round to lead you lambs to the slaughter in, uh, in the principality of all that is uh, just right and proper. You will find that a conditional acceptance is one of the highest and cleanest and honourable ways in which to answer in your public status as a um, member of the general public an infant and infantry bullet catcher in this unholy ungodly war where you are in fact a ghost of your former blood and flesh um, authentic uh, sovereign suzerain um, incarnate uh, you know um, graceful self there so uh, we know and we simply give you ideas those of you on youtube putting up witty comments and not knowing why you don't annoy me you don't vexate me after 700 videos and three years i would have expected the basics to have dropped in if they don't drop in by now then you think i'm going to spend the time to try to further educate you and enlighten you and illuminate you I tried to take you from frightened to enlightened and after 36 months and 700 videos, if the basic conceptualization of protection hasn't dropped in and fallen into place, then I'm very, very sorry, trapped in a 
<coughs> dark, shadowy place with cognitive dissonance. You know, I have claircognizance. And those of you that have paid attention to the post know, you know how this works and you know something is wrong without knowing exactly why. And later on, it will present itself in full detail or when you're ready to learn, the teacher will appear. All right, I rest it there. So that explains that. You are free to choose to go or not go or to do or to not do. We simply inform and enlighten to save you being frightened. Protection of rights. Legal maxim, those that do not know they have any rights, therefore have no rights. Okay then, so we will retain our reserve our rights at all times. Two witnesses in a legal environment and in an international supreme law environment under the covenants and articles mean that there are facts present. So if you can get um, some credible uh, parties, uh, notaries, in fact, when I say notaries, I don't mean notary public or public notary, I mean notarized witnesses to attest to the fact. Then there are facts present at law, um, legal, Roman, secular, um, international and with the private side. So you see now why we have presented an instrument called a proclamation, evidence of life and essence, incarnate, testified, proclaimed, um, referenceable. And you will get the videos next, later, and it will be in depth and it will screen share and I will go through quite a lot of the publications I have shared with you, not just uh, the recent ones that I've shared through this group on uh, FB, SPLs, where we're going through somewhat of the Christian disclosure. The four horsemen of the apocalypse are used for this thumbnail. I don't use that lightly. They are here. That would be in no particular order. There is a white horsey, a red horsey, a blue horsey, and a multicolored green and red ghostly horsey there. We'll go for Jeff Bezos on the white horse. We'll go for Mark of the Zuckerberg on the red horse there. We'll go for William Bates on the blue horse. And we'll go for Elon Musk, a.k.a. SpaceX, X, say 10, X marks the spot pirate uh, wielding sheath man of death and uh, AI uh, fourth industrial conceptualization neurological transmission of data via digital methods what yes we use the uh, the particle matrix there and the angelic side of things on the quantum uh, lineage so uh, all this is pinned together by that cloud in the background and that cloud can be klaus klaus is the cloud the cloud of klaus he's the backup fifth um apocalyptic fifth horseman um if one of these um, four that I've just mentioned happens to fall down and uh, gets furloughed. Horses, furlough, hey, 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 that's not my name. That's my main, main attraction. I'm in it for the long game. Let's put the bets on, odds on each way. All right, uh, chattel, herds, jabs, immunity. Um, I, for one, have had more than uh, ducking enough. All right, I'm ducking in and out. Um, we're protecting you. And we're giving you what we can see happening. Those of you that do not wish to continue or think this is uh, folly and hear say, move on, stop the video, unsubscribe, leave the group, get out of here. We don't need it anymore. How is Kevin? Thank you for asking. Um, Kevin is relaxing and resting. He's, a, he's the lion in the den and he's looking after the cub, so to speak. He's well, he's healthy is good and um and uh, we're staying in touch he's a legend and um we love him lots give love and sp and spanks <laughs> love and thanks to that brother there um thank you for asking brother Stuart. you are going to get some gans sent down to you as well um in the next week i promise you maybe tomorrow don't hold me to that we'll see how it goes but i will get you some gans down for your brother if that is the same Stuart. i think it is um, I've explained why we're using the evidence of life, essence and incarnation and how it is, you know, affected there. And um, these documents that you need to um, protect yourself that I have uh, spent over probably um, a thousand man hours on. And I've explained on the two pages of the dot com there. Um, once you click your EOL um 
E L E I, sorry, uh, evidence of life, essence, incarnation, and you look at those pages, you will find that there is, um, you know, uh, a great, uh, I don't know, three, four thousand words on one page, and another page has got the same again, and um, you will find that there is a um, a series of documents that I have mentioned that I would like to give to you or make you um, aware of, and um, they will be in no particular order. Um, a proclamation of sovereignty explained what I've, I've uploaded uh, yesterday to FB documents download you can find that now um, hefty read insightful as to the crowns Babylon agents kings bishops families luminatus luminati etc um, that should be the first document you read if you have got access to Facebook files now after this video or during this video I'd like you to look at a proclamation of sovereignty explained version 4 heavyweight 2021 edition take your time get that um, digested there is um, there is an introduction into evidence life essence and incarnation being done by G star that's going to be made public that we'll share with the family and let you know why we would need to have an alternative to a legal evidence of identity. Okay, um, you're going to have um, an affidavit and notice in declaration of a lodial ownership of property. That's at version two. There is a SPLS Pro 2020 data protection GDPR request version three. That's for you to get data from companies. There is an ecclesiastical private and lawful deed poll version three. Um, and that's primarily influenced by Frank of the O'Collins fam. Those of you that do your work, David of the Russell and um, uh, Billy Bob and David Bob and whoever else you've got there. Um, uh, identity wise, I forget how many accounts and names you have there, David. Um, but uh, that and you and I and others know Frank O'Collins is to be heralded for coming out with the um, ecclesiastical deed poll. All right, a deed poll is simply legally a change of name. Okay, changing your name, um, deed poll, but an an ecclesiastical one um, is uh, is totally different and uh, it involves changing of name. All right, deed poll. So when you read these documents, bear that in mind. An executor appointment version three. We have a SPLS Pro last will and testament. It's got two versions on a lawful non legal one and a legal one plain and simple legal and that's at version five we have a crown and private agent unilateral non-disclosure agreement and fee schedule 2021 version four we have a declaration to suella braveman the attorney general qc uh, mp declaration the reasons for that will be explained at a later date we have a good faith notice of render influenced by Daniel Christian Remedy at Law. That's on version 5. And we have a Deputy Registrar, General Trustee, Keeper of the Holy Seal and Faith, version 5. Who is the Keeper of the Holy Seal and Faith, I ask you. We have the uh, affidavit of truth to the Home Secretary, the Right Honourable Pretty Patel, MP. OK, and we have before you get any of that, we have an, uh, a brand new and uh, simple non-disclosure agreement that you will need to have to agree to. It's unilateral. It's from us, the discloser to you, the recipient of the uh, documents that I've just read out before any of them are disclosed and given to anybody, anyone then you will have to agree to that uh, unilateral non-disclosure agreement, all right? So uh, heads up, we have content creators and unconscionable ones that do not like I, that hate me, that won't speak to me, that won't work with me, that won't have a hangout podcast chat or even come together. But yet you will hang around to try and pick the bones, get some meat off in the form of the work and the sweat equity that we have done there. All right, we have created a Genesis Trust. We are exodusing from this war that we are in. We're not here to bring down the system. We're not here to attack the system. We know that the system is here to stay. It's part of the Hegelian dialect and the synthesis of the fabric of the universe. Good and hate exist. Love and hate, good and evil, 
you know, it's a bit like the Pope kissing the tank there. You've got the man of the house of God, their house of God, the Roman Catholic house of God, not my house of God, but the Pope kissing the um, German, the Italian and the American and the English tanks. OK, having a relationship with presidents and prime ministers that are having foreign war policies and starting a war. So you have the hate and the evil on one side and tanks and munitions, weapons, infantries, death and blood. Thou shalt not kill. The man comes out there and kisses the tank. So therefore you've got the good and just insanity. It really is. Uh, no wonder we're all confused and wanting to drink wine at nine o'clock and the amount of U-turns and uh, failings by the secretaries and generals and uh, everybody is uh, is leaving us to manage it ourselves. Judging by the last year, would you trust any of these um, buffoons to competently run your life, your children's life or anything else? No, is the answer from I. Um, we had Cummings, Gove and Johnson on national news admitting to crimes of going to drive when they can't see yes yeah, so we go for a drive when we believe we're ill and sick and our vision is impaired the first thing we do is get in the iron horse why is it an iron horse it's measured in horsepower it has a tailgate it has a tailpipe okay that's why it's measured in it's called a horse four horsemen of the apocalypse horses names manes very interesting but we're moving on gove Cummings Johnson all professed on national news to driving when they can't see and they've got impaired vision. You want them to competently manage? You know, um, we've got Nicola Sturgeon in Scotland, the first minister. OK, what's the first minister? Well, Boris Johnson is the first Lord of the Treasury and he's the prime minister. Prime is another word for uno, one, the first Minister, the Prime Minister. So what's uh, that fishy lady up there doing, uh, Sturgeon, uh, of the Nicola? Um, I'll let you think about that and who she is. Um, why is Matt Hancock in the Privy Council? What is the Privy Council? Why have we got Sir Kia Starmer um, battling with Boris? You'd think at a time like this that they'd join together and make some kind of a coalition mm -hmm. for the good of all, for the good of public health. Oh, no, we can't do that. No, no, no. We're the guys that drive mm -hmm. when we're completely blind. Oh, insane. Absolutely insane. Can you pay with silver? I'm being asked for things. With us, you can transfer tiny amounts of silver. You want to transfer for an evidence of life and essence, and you don't want to use fiat currency. Instead of going to the crypto, more dead, crypt, families are putting crypt. Yes, you want to say hello to us, and you want to transfer instead of sweat equity, instead of PayPal, instead of bank transfers and fiat currency and more <laughs> of that nature. And you want to transfer silver to us for the equivalent of an evidence of life or um, a, a private annual subscription or a donation um, to help our trust. Then, yes, we will accept silver. Um, not so much interested in gold because um, it's so expensive and transferring pounds of gold is flakes really but silver at the present how it is to a brother called nick your question has just been answered indeed you can let me go to the screen and roll back through what we've got there um, and what's happening yes Stuart, you're welcome ian hello there let's give you a wave any questions any feedback uh, Stuart? you are today's top uh, chatter thank you for that in partaking in this natter these are all important matters <sighs> i'm gonna let you just have a moment there facebook tube I'll let you type and from the top again you will find that the main files that I have shared, in addition to what you've already got, there are 337 to choose from and download on the uh, private domain. But starting from me, what we've got um, shared last night and recently, and I will keep sharing and promoting, is the PDF, Caesar's Messiah. It's not too deep. It is a good read. And like I say, if you want to get off the media networks, then you may want to consider doing a bit of reading 
and getting back to me with your conjecture and questions, articulation, input, and etc. The next file that I've shared was the Civil Judicial Template for Justice. That's the 2018 final version two. That does need an update, but that's one of our uh, foundation key competence from your Sovereign Masters Guild. There's also part of that same publication. You've got the CQV, the Setter KV Quasi Trust version two, 2019 PDF document. PDF, PDF, as it actually says there. You've also got in that same publication of the SMG, the Principles of Trust Law Governance, the Master Servant Slavery PDF. I also have shared one called Truth, that's uh, dated the 1st of the 12th, 19. All right, so I'd like you to look at that. Thank you, Karen, for liking that. Out of 600 and odd in 12 hours, we've had two likes on that. And last but not least, 147 pages deep, part of the Christian disclosure with the password splspro.com 2020 um, Christmas story, the facts. Um, nobody has actually given any energy on that in this room full of watchers, watchmen. Um, and uh, and others, so uh, I don't expect many to chat, many to speak up. Shout going out to Greg of the Meanwell clan when I said that you have failed, and ninety percent of you have failed with the interaction, the sharing, the caring, the positivity. I meant that, and I stand by it. Greg stepped up and said, "I may be a watcher, but that doesn't mean to say I'm failing." I said, "Well, I'm not here to judge." But uh, evidently so it does. Actions speak louder than words. And if your actions are minimal, you need to execute some deeds and you haven't. We've asked for help and you haven't stepped up. We've given you stuff to articulate and come back to us and give us your praise and grumbles. And you haven't. And you're waiting for the administrative remedy. Then by great Scott, the universal principality of the forces of nature themselves, you failed. Not by me. Not by splspro.com but by the governance and the covenants of the uh, of the higher forces above. So uh, those of you that are wondering why, um, you know, Matt Hancock's and people like uh, the Privy Council Crown Agent members, Sirs, Lords and etc. are um, looking like they're lying and you're trying to deal with them with Magna Carta that may have been invoked in 2001. They're doing their job, much like Sir Ian Duncan Smith that got a knighthood last year for culling the disabled benefits after you know such tricks as putting in expensive claims for his undercrackers whilst taking money off the less abled aka disabled personal independent payments department for work and pensions yes he got knighted for doing his job right they are protected crown agents you want to go and use crown technology to attack crown agents you're off your rocker you are tripping your tits off all right constitutional um, promoters we don't want to hear from that magna carta 1215 promoters you're a joke we don't want to hear from that you are seeing the strength we have pointed out the strength and if you cannot see that like i pointed out to trapped in a room about the simple conditional acceptance the strength the honor the clean hands you're not listening and david de surrey um david russell david bob definition of legal um seven likes and hearts Thank you for that. Uploaded the 2nd of June 2020. That man I get confused with. He's got more profiles than a 50 pence has sides. But he seems to speak some kind of truth. Whom and what he is, I'm not sure. He doesn't speak. He doesn't interact. He's got many profiles. He appears to be clever. He claimed to have got remedy. But never really helped me out. Much like Stephen and wanting five grand. Claimed didn't help me out couldn't find the reason to hand over five grand. So when you're umming and ahhing about 19.99 and transferring and uh, etc., just think, look at the names on that page of the evidence of life and incarnation. Let's drop some names here. Let's do some name bombs as well of all of the ones that have promised and said they've got remedy. From the top, and in no particular order, but it does look like there's an order here, if I'm honest, and my subconscious has... Um, subconsciously put this in an order here we go drum roll please Franco Collins Santos Bonacci Jordan Maxwell Napoleon Hill Alan Watts Greg Braden Bruce Lipton Noam Chomsky Bill Turner NZ Daniel Christian Remedy at law 
Max Egan, <laughs> um, Stephen, Steve, McRae, Bincham, John, Agent Smith, Common Law Court, Glossa Channel, Romley Stewart, Mark, So Long, Sail On, Sail On, um, Sail On, Sail On, sorry, C E Y L O N, not Sail as in boat, but Sail On, Seal On. Um, thank you to the brother that pointed that out. Sri Lanka C, aka Justin Walker. Tom Crawford, British Constitution Group, Practical Lawful Descent, David Robinson, Michael Obanissia, TGBMS, John Harris, he should have been somewhere at the beginning to be fair, my subconscious let me down on that one, but there you go, so that's why it's in no particular order, officially, UK Colin Brian Garish and tens of others, how many of them have given any of you remedy, how many of them have given you um, uh, what you need? Um, I can't find anything there. I did miss out to uh, kindness credits, we buy any debt, and a lady known um, allegedly by the calling of Elizabeth, Elizabeth Death, Nelson, Nelson. So uh, again, uh, give me your feedback, comments. If I have, uh, you know, uh, missed any of the uh, of the remedies that they they promised, then, then then please, I implore you, let me know, tell me. If you've got good feedback over two years intensively i've been looking and uh, i've learned some stuff from you know the the names above um these have uh, influenced me entertained me offended me uh, uh, and i have studied from you know i'm not saying any names in particular you are the ones with your discovery and you can work that out for yourself i do not need to tell you who what to follow how to think, what to think, or anything like that. You are intelligent enough to make your own decisions. Those of them that you, them, names that have made claims on me in the public, I've asked for proof of claim for the defamation of character, slander and libelous, or I will be coming for blood, man, not persons, and claiming the damages, and I will make a meal of such like Gary Law, a.k.a. Lucy D, a.k.a. Gary Davis, again, another user of this domain with multiple IDs, and Elizabeth publicly slating on YouTube and um, Facebook. Um, others have done so, and I've had to put them to bed and uh, obviously use the law that we've become um, known for and ask them and publicly record everything, hold them to account, and then suddenly it goes quiet. They go into little groups and little messages, and thank you all for sending me the screenshots of those private groups, secret groups, and messages. I love you. I will never release who you are. You look after me. You've got my back. I've got your back, just like that lion in that picture. Fact. True. And uh, it stands. So, question times, and we are done. We are finished. I do like caning lockdown three, schools closed. I don't like the way he can't spend time with his five-year-old without smashing his face into a book. I find that embarrassing. Boris's latter part of the uh, announcement last night, um, I find that um, sickening. You may leave your home for these reasons and also domestic violence. What the duck is going on here? I can't ducking believe this. Am I really to believe my shell likes and my mince pies when I see and hear that? Yes, I am. That's the true state of our society at the moment. We are here to install some social um, stability nationwide and on an international basis. Those of you wondering, can I make a proclamation of uh, evidence of life, essence, incarnation? Am I, can I be sovereign? Is it just the landmass Britain and the Republic of New Britain that you've created, Dave, that is sovereign? No. All international countries that are signed up to the uh, ratified covenants of the United Nations may make um, this evidence, life, essence, incarnation and use the fact that all humans are um, given the right to be recognised as persons in front of the law. Or you can decline that right to be recognised as a person in front of the law in an international level. Again, we are pioneering this. Nobody brought this to me. I've made it. I found it. I digested it. I am using it. Much like we've coined a few other terms recently. So if you're wondering 
if you uh, can do this, it's a lot easier if your landmass nation state there was signed up and ratified to one of the UN covenants, treaties, articles, human rights, bosh, 100%, all right, done deal. If you'd like to uh, to come and have a chat with us on an international level and you're not on um, splspro.com and you're not in the landmass Britain, formerly known as England and Wales, the United Kingdom of Great Britain, Anglica and etc. You can still join us and we can still save you. If you're not a white Catholic Christian and you are of Islamic faith, Judaism or non-Catholic, you can still be saved. And I have the remedy for all creeds and races, okay, for the private securing of. You will not end up like Julian Assange up in Belmarsh um, being without his rights because he is a man at law that does not know his rights and i'd find that hard very hard to believe that julian of the assange doesn't know that he has rights therefore ergo his defense team barristers um uh, representors haven't done their job well and neither is julian he's posed national security threats allegedly and given out secrets of government nature on a international level we do not do that we tell you the truth we find the things that dan brown wants to confuse you with and others that uh, you know I won't mention all the names and we just we just correct it and we tell you and we give you what your rights are and we tell you how to retain your rights and uh, trust and equity David isn't isn't used for protecting man it's only for property well I say to you like I said to the London Inner Temple um, Society of Law that rights are classified as property and if rights are classified as property and man is from the land on an abrahamic sense yes uh, abrahamic sense and uh, you've got the jc influence in all three faiths there and we have um, rights that are not given to us by government okay they are uh, unalienable unalienable and, uh, and 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 you abuse them then i can prove using trust and equity abrahamic biblical non-legal that you've just abused my property and those that abuse property are tantamount to terrorism and terrorism of property is therefore how we roll okay so if you're a little bit confused on that front we don't use legal trust and equity we don't use ecclesiastical trust and equity we go for the third one abrahamic trust and equity it is as old as the old testament itself given to you in the book of genesis Figure that out with your fig leaf around your private parts. I yield. We're going to questions. Video ending. God bless us all. Granter of dominion. The walking dead are about to be incarnate. The war is over. And uh, those of you that like to carry on and take down the system and get boots on the ground, crack on. Those of you that don't think it's necessary to correct your status, standing and capacity and protect your biological estate, your fundamental estate and your residual um, incorporeal property as well as your corporeal property, then crack on. I say it with love and I say it with respect. That's why we're number one in the game, all right? The game of life. And anyone that wants to say we're not, I, I invite you to uh, tell me why we're not, all right? Bosch, Radika and Mark have a wave. Shabba. I like what I say and I say what I like. There you go. So yeah, once again, love to all. I'm here to help. I'm not here to poke fun. I'm not here to gloat. I'm not here to do anything else other than my job and the sacred contract. Okay. Thank you for the seven comments and the four emoticons of thumbs up, hearts and likes. I have shared this once. You may download this. And uh, introduce us, I, and the uh, the private remedy that we have for the Seta KV at hand, and um, why and how we have that. I've given you more than enough over the years. I have clean hands. Soon I will be fully private, and you will not see or hear from me in the public domain again. All right, we are slowly tapering off to the private. In case you haven't noticed, those of you on Indiglo, nothing personal. It's a matter of politics and protection, and um, none of you. I've done anything wrong, even the trills. I love you lots. You are me and I am you in each other's reflection. But I am saddened and disappointed for the reasons contained within this uh, video, testification, proclamation. You are all here to notarise these facts to the matter, the material evidences. Boom. 
going to go and get some likes on there to Brother Stuart. <laughs> and that's it then. We are done. If I may just uh, put you in the queue then whilst I uh, I do some more administrative errors. Those of you that, wouldn't, that, that know this music on the landmass um, known as England and Wales, this music is looped up, by the, was looped up by the Department of Work and Pensions for 30 seconds at a time. 30 seconds at a time. And then it used to restart. The reason that they've taken this off last year at the beginning is because it was seen to vexate man. Why was it seen to vexate man? Because sometimes you'd be in the queue for an hour listening to this on a 30 minute loop, 30 second loop me get this right and you're on the phone for an hour so if this is repeated every 30 seconds that's twice in a minute 60 minutes in an hour you've listened to this for 120 times and then when the agents come to answer the phone do you know what they were doing they was hanging up and man was having to ring back rejoin the queue and listen to it for props another hour an hour and a half so you may have heard this loop 300, 240 to 300 times before you got to speak to a human being. And what they do there, I'm just going to have to stop that because it is, it will be causing nightmares and horrendous things for man all over. But uh, because they want to appear like a department of the government and it's a private corporation they play vivaldi the four seasons to make it look like it's affiliated with what with the monarchy when it isn't it's one of those little deceptive measures that we find um, people do um, often play to uh, to make you think you know uh, that you're dealing with governmental departments there is no government as such the legal system at hand is the government of man you follow legal you write in black and you use capital names and that's the new world order itself and that is the legal system which is the government there is no building called government you've got parliament you've got commons you've got lords you've got privy councils you've got select committees you've got the queen you've got downing street you've got officers and agents and secretaries and chief in staff yes chief in staff imagine that uh, in, in picture that and, uh, and that's what you have. There is no building called the government. And this is where we are getting out of. And uh, legal, the undoing of God's law. Black pen, blue pen, maritime admiralty. Red pen, mm. purple pen, mm. black and blue. They'll beat you black and blue and they'll leave them bruises just as sure. You know, the club that they beat you with is the club that they're in. To quote George Carling, and you're not in it and they beat you with it every day. We yield there, okay? So, uh, more videos to come. Public one of a walkthrough for those of you that want to see and potentially come in and have a look. Um, you will be entertained, to say the least, enlightened and hopefully not frightened. If you'd like a little bit of a freestyle rap there, go back to the beginning of this video and have a listen to how I started that. And uh, we say much love, thanks, respect. Stay sovereign, stay self-governing, stop beating each other up, stop drinking wine and self-medicating, let's learn to work together, um, utilise our private uh, status, alright, our standing is lawful and our capacity is man, for those of you wondering why status, standing and capacity is important, um, please look at the posts that I've done recently, digest them, try and look at the publications, Turn off the box and um, you know where to find us if you'd like further help, enlightenment or you'd like to come and ask questions or critique is equally as important. Um, showing me any errors, any any uh, areas of which you would like to see enlightened, grown, let me know. Bless up. Much love.